What's up guys, your man Chef from Off The Dome back in for another quick video. Today we're here to talk about Beyonce versus Kellis and what's going on, what's right, what's wrong. Overall with the situation, I can kind of see from both sides. Kellis wasn't approached by Beyonce personally to use her sample, I'm assuming of Milkshake. La la, la la, la, that little part of Milkshake. Beyonce used that and instead went and got it from the people who own her masters, which is Pharrell Williams and I'm assuming the label. Now, that in itself, I kind of get why Kels is hurt. However, unfortunately, it is common decent. I can see what she's saying, but unfortunately, that's the way the music game and how life is. Whoever owns the stuff is the person who gets access to stuff. Now, fans are combating and coming back at Kels saying that she's stupid for what she said because she's ruining a check. Because apparently, Beyonce put Kels as a songwriter on the song Energy. So that would have got Kels a check, a royalty check, finally, from the song Milkshake, which she doesn't get from the original song Milkshake currently, which is one of the biggest hits of 2003 Milkshake was. And it's used in movies and all types of memes. Milkshake is the generation-defining song. So they're saying that Kels ruined... Fast cars. They said that Kellis ruined her chance to have a bag in 2022. Now, it goes both ways. Maybe Kellis doesn't care about the bag. Maybe it's strictly about respect for her. And if it's about respect only, then I understand why Kellis wants to be asked up front and straightforwardly if they can use her song. Because the bag doesn't matter as much as it matters about the respect to her. Some people are saying the bag should matter more because she can finally get paid off a song which she's never got paid off of. So, and all that being said, I believe that respect it's more valuable than money in certain circumstances. And sometimes you just want to take the money and deal with the problem a different way later on. Let me know what you would have did if you was Kellis. Personally, I would have just got the bag. But, however, I've never seen the money Kellis has had. I've never been in that circle Kellis has had. So maybe she doesn't need the money as bad as we think she does. One hit one is have money as well. Or do you think that Kellis should have just went ahead and she's justified for standing up for herself? Let me know what you think. It's your man Chef from Off the Dome. I'm signing out. Peace.